And welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you can tell, I am in the locker room at the strip club. So I'm going to be doing a get ready with me video. Showing me looking like this. So completely ready for work. I did come to work super early today. Just because I didn't want to record like girls walking in the back. Just for like their privacy. And I don't want to just like be recording people, you know. So if you guys want to see me completely get ready for work. Then keep watching. So I know that I have already showed you guys the locker room so many times and I literally have a strip club tour but I just wanted to show you guys one more time that there is a shower back here in the bathroom area so that's super cool because if girls ever need to take a shower here they can. Okay, you guys, I just got out of the shower. It feels so weird saying that because I'm at the club, but we do have a shower and like a kitchen and a whole bunch of stuff in the club. So that's really convenient if you need to shower at the club. So now that I'm out of the shower, I'm about to do my skincare routine. Okay, you guys, I put my clothes back on because the towel was really hard to stay on, but I'm just going to wash my face now. I'm using the Teamy Superfoods Cleanser. It looks like this, so let's get started. This is what my skin looks like before. As you guys know, I was on Accutane, and since I got off Accutane, my skin has started breaking out again, so I'm really just trying to like use products to clear it up. So this has been helping me a lot, actually, and sorry I'm like this. It's just because, you know, I need to see the camera because if I stand up, you can't see it, so yeah. So basically you just wet your face and I put two pumps it's just green and I like it because it smells super good it smells literally like apples and it's like really lightweight it doesn't feel heavy especially if you're gonna like put makeup on after So this is what my skin looks like after washing my face with the super food cleanser it is super lightweight and like refreshing my skin looks a lot smoother and i feel like it helps also like reduce the redness from my acne so really good now step two is going to be the vitamin c serum so the vitamin c serum looks like this this is something that i used to never use i would never really use serums on my face but i feel like it's really important to add a serum to like your skincare routine because it is super hydrating it lessens the appearance of lines it smooths out your skin and helps it glow especially like when you're gonna put makeup on so it won't get in the cracks and stuff like that so i'm about to put this on They also do have like the detoxing mask that you guys have seen me use in my videos before. I used that last night. So if you guys also want like a good face mask, they have like the green detoxing mask. And I really, really like that. So if you were to do like the detox mask and like all these steps, your skin will be right. So the last step in my Teamy skincare routine is this repair oil. I really like this. I was skeptical about putting it on my skin at first just because I didn't want to clog my pores. But this does hydrate your skin without clogging your pores. So I really, really like that. It also protects your skin. And it has these like calamine tea flowers in there. And those help like heal your skin. So I do have a lot of like acne scars and stuff like that. So it helps me heal those. it for my teeny skincare routine i was just using the facial cleanser looks like this the vitamin c serum and then lastly the repair oil just three really easy steps i do have a code for 25 percent off if you guys are interested in checking out these face products like i said they also do have the detoxifying mask if you're really into doing face masks like i am so you can use code christina25 for 25 percent off and now i'm about to go do my hair and my makeup okay you guys i'm with lisa we're both getting ready for work but now i'm about to do my makeup i brought hella stuff because i didn't know what i was gonna need I literally never get ready at work, so this is so weird for me. My face feels really 
smooth and ready to go. I actually really like that oil and stuff. And at first, I'm like, I don't want to put oil on my face, but. Dude, your skin looks so rejuvenated. Look at me. See? She needs to do the teamy cleanse because I feel like it makes my skin look brighter. Yeah. And I feel like my makeup's about to go on so much smoother mm -hmm. now, low key, now that I use that stuff. Which color am I? What can we talk about? You guys, the strip club opens up at 12 in the afternoon. But no one really comes this early. So there's literally nobody here right now. Because technically the strip club right now is open. And it's like 12 p.m. But there's no guests out there. I feel like people don't start coming till like 5 at the earliest. I didn't even know we opened up this early. Well, if there's people that are still like working from home, they might come here on their lunch break. Because lucky there's good food here. Oh yeah, people do come here I think on their lunch break. You might have to talk loud because the like vent is on or something. See, this is what I'm gonna like, use one of your lighter ones. So I'll try to even this out. Oh, I think there's a girl auditioning right now. Cool. There, there are a few girls here because like waitresses and like bartenders. I think they're like on a schedule, so they actually have to be here. Once the bubble. You guys, we should only do our makeup up here because we have to wear a mask. They're not even going to be able to see Yeah. I just don't want anyone to walk past and then I accidentally record them and then I get in trouble. I should I curl my hair straight? I do my makeup so bad. You're so wet, kind of. Yeah, my hair is wet too. Like all under here. I can't find the eyelash curler I normally use, so I'm just using this one, which I don't really like it because it doesn't really work. I mean, I have lip gloss, but it's kind of pointless because we have to wear a mask, but I guess I'll just put some. And then some highlights. That dress is so pretty. This girl's wearing a dress and it's really pretty. And I know a lot of you guys have been asking about my nose because you can see that it's crooked and slanted right here. And I'm gonna be making my vlog on my nose really soon. Like I'm filming that probably later today. Well, probably not today because I'm working, but I'm gonna film that probably tomorrow because I wanna post it sometime this week. I know a lot of you guys have been asking about my nose update and I feel like I just wanted it to be like completely not completely healed but like a lot more healed because now I'm like five months post-op so now I feel like people actually believe me that it didn't come out right I don't know I'm gonna be doing a video on that though. okay this is pretty much it for my makeup because I don't really do my makeup like that so yeah now I'm gonna do my hair Okay, so I know that the clubs in Chicago are like back opened up like after the pandemic thing. So I'm curious to know if like the strip clubs by you guys are opened up. So let me know what like city you're from and if the clubs by you guys are opened up yet. Because I have a friend who lives in Vegas and the clubs over there are still not open. Didn't and I they thought, open Vegas back up and then close it again? I don't know. No, I think Vegas, like the casinos and stuff open, but the strip clubs aren't. Oh. Because they have like a lot of tourists that come, you know? Mm -hmm. And I'm curious too if this club is gonna end up closing again. If it's just not going up in here. Well, that usually happens. It's because it, my hair is wet. Because I know some places opened up and then closed again. So I feel like, what if this club closes again? That would be crazy. That's the club phone ring, by the way. The 
house mom isn't even here yet because the house mom usually gets here at like 5 or 6 p.m. So if you come early, there's no house mom. We're just burning our hair over here, no big deal. Shizzle. So it's like 1 p.m. right now. The house mom is not here yet. Like I said, they get here later in the day because usually there's not a lot of girls. So I think there's only like two or three girls here right now besides us. So with us, it'll make like four or five. But there's like the waitress, because obviously there needs to be a waitress just in case someone comes in. And then there's one dancer. And then I don't know if there's like a bartender out there, but there's not a lot of people just because it's still really early. And also it's a Monday. So it's during the week, so it's not going to be that busy. That's why I chose to film on this day, so it's not very busy. And then also COVID, so it's a lot of factors. What else can we talk about? Okay, you guys. So basically, I'm going to be starting my own like stripper clothing line soon called Tina V Dancewear. I haven't really like posted anything about it yet. I did make an Instagram page for it. It's literally called Tina V Dancewear. I guess I'll just like link it down below if you guys want to check it out. I haven't really posted anything on there yet, but I feel like I'm a stripper and I know things that I want to wear. So I'm just going to do like a little clothing line for dancers. And I want to make like a starter pack. So like if you've never worked before, so it'll be like a cute dress with like a thong, a garter, a money bag, like a little, you know, starter pack. Oh, it's so cute. Yeah. I'm really excited for this. I was thinking about it when I was in the shower earlier. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to be doing like two pieces, one pieces, like everything's going to have rhinestones. It's going to be so freaking cute. And I'm really excited because I feel like there's not that many places in Chicago to get stripper clothes. I feel like it's either Lover's Lane or like Lover's Paradise and that's pretty much it. Unless yeah. you just get stuff online. Amazon. Yeah, but I feel like like when you go to Miami, like that one like Miami vlog that I did, there was hella stripper stores in Miami just because like the industry is so much bigger out there, and they have like industrial like big stripper stores, and we don't really have that here, so I'm really excited. So stay tuned for that, y'all. Once I get like the clothes and like start working on it more, I'll definitely do a video like showing the outfits and trying them on and stuff like that. Yeah, and I tried to pick out stuff for like different body types, not just stuff that I would wear. Because I do, I am really tiny and I have a small torso, so I wanted like some stuff for girls like that. And then like for thicker girls, skinny girls, tall girls. Like I tried to get like a variety of different stuff. So, I'm excited to do that. Also, I feel like um, some of the stuff that you picked out, like, it doesn't have to be like stripper stuff. Like you could wear it. Oh yeah, you could wear yeah. it like out normal. That is true. Like, some of the, like, two pieces, like, bikinis that I picked out, literally could be worn at the beach as, like, a regular bikini. Yeah. So, I'm just excited to show you guys everything. And then, like, if it does well, like, just to keep coming out with different designs and stuff like that. So, yeah. It's gonna be good. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. show you guys everything that I brought. I just have my face mask because Corona, you gotta wear a face mask. Here. And then I brought a bunch of dresses. 
mask. I bought this pink one. It's just stretchy. Matches the mask. I brought this pink one. Has diamonds on it. Super cute. And then I bought this one. It's like this animal print. It's like stretchy. It's cute too. And then I bought this bikini. You never know. And then I bought this one because I actually think I'm going to wear underneath. Because here we're only allowed to wear dresses. We can't wear like bikinis and one pieces, but we can wear them underneath our dress. So then when you go on stage and you take the dress off, you're wearing like a one piece. So I think I'm going to wear that and then a dress over it. So can you wear one of these? Um, should I wear this with this? Yeah, that'd be really good. Okay. I'm going to wear this one. Okay, this is the one piece I'm going to wear. Looks like this. It's pink and gold and it has these little rhinestones on it. Super cute. This is the dress that I'm gonna wear. It's like a one strapper. And it's got, ooh, it's got this in the back. See, and I'm gonna wear this dress, but this is gonna be under it and they kinda look this. Oh dang, they look the yeah. same. Yeah. Oh, that's I did so not cute. even plan this or have them. I did not yeah, they didn't come together. together. And look, it has gold right here, and this is gold, and it, damn, this is so good. Because I'm going to wear this one piece underneath this, like that. Okay, we're going to get dressed now. And then I'm going to wear these pink garters underneath for the money. I'm wearing these, black ones. And then I'm going to wear these underwear. It just matches the one piece. Um, it's a look. Right now I'm wearing the one piece, but I can't really show it to you guys because I'll get demonetized to see through. But I'm gonna put the dress over it now. The dress is see through too, so I don't even know. But it's so pretty. Okay, you guys, we just finished, you know, our hair, our makeup, and then we got into our outfits. So we're gonna show you in the full length mirror what they look like. So let's go. Oh, the flash. So these are the outfits. Oh, we're both wearing pink. The front, the back. Oh, I'll see how you like, okay? And then our shoes. Cute. We got our little masks. Oh, she's wearing hers. I have my mask right here on my wrist. So, yeah, you guys, we're pretty much all ready to go. Okay, we are completely done getting ready. We got our little masks, our fits on. So now we're about to walk out into the club. I obviously can't bring my phone out there because we're not allowed to have our devices out there. So we're about to go out that door and try to get this money i hope you guys liked this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel thank you time's out there's no one here yet so i'm gonna record a little bit for you guys the club is literally so empty we're here early early <laughs> well i guess i can get a good thumbnail in okay if you stay to the very end this is just me waiting to get a dance or something but no one's here yet so okay now this is really the end of the video love you bye